Rockets dominated the first meeting early this season. Now the Mavericks and the Rockets meet again tonight on FSN Houston. On the Rockets winning without Yao Ming, I don't know why everybody's so surprised at what they're doing. Everybody seems to act like all of a sudden they got good. That's a hilarious thing to me. Guard is to keep your dribble alive no matter where you're at on the court. We'll see plenty enough of Steve Nash tomorrow night. Points in that game. And he's not even in this contest. There's T-Mac now. He'll shoot it over Josh Howard since Yao Ming has been out. And that's where Dikembe can affect this game is on the, on the defensive board. Rating. Falls back and hits. T-Mac down here on the post. See, they've got Josh Howard on him now. T-Mac just a step back. Oh, that's nasty. Brady turns the corner, takes it in for two. Both believe that if, if the Rockets would have had Jerron Howard in that series, the Rockets would have won. But Brady says, give it to me. And Brady gets a pick from Matumbo. Jerron Howard hits from the outside. And McGrady hits again. Game. And McGrady. Again, is Tracy McGrady. Here's T-Mac on this side of the court. He's on the weak side because the ball's over here. Now, Juwan Howard's going to come down and set a pick, and Dikembe Mutombo's going to set a pick. Okay, now stop it right right here. Okay, stop it right here. Here's Shane Battier. Look, he's looking at T-Mac to see where he's going. Another thing to watch, watch the pick by Dikembe. Let him come off the pick. Dikembe gets to the rear end into the defender. T-Mac comes off shooting. And Rafer takes it, brings it out. Juwan gets it back. Sets up Rafer again, straight on for a three. He hits it. Harding Stackhouse. Stackhouse can just go to work on the post. Brady. Good pick by Dikembe. And take a look at Dikembe's pick. When you're defending T-Mac, you can't run right into the pick. You'll never get around Dikembe. And take a look at this last pass by Ray for Olsen. Little Look at that English. The spin on that pass to get it along the baseline. Brady. Hits again. Bill Worrell is working his magic again. Remember in the Kings game, they uh, counted a counted a three point shot. Go ahead, Bill. Go ahead and talk. Let me, but what happened was is that three pointer by Tracy McGrady was counted only as a two by the officials, and he was a good foot behind the three point line. I thought they were going to give him a three, but they only gave him a two. Now let's check it out again here. Yeah, see so Tracy, he's definitely behind the line. You can see that's obvious there, and the officials are discussing now in the Sacramento Kings. Kings game, Bill Worrell was able to get up for Dallas. Battier with a hook shot for two. <laughs> and Chuck oh, has to be outside of the cylinder. Tracy McGrady, one thing he can do is finger roll. And Dikembe, that the ball was very, very close. Could have been still in the cylinder. Could have been out. Dan Pierce sets a pick. Harris to the lane. Blocked by Matumbo. <laughs> Wagging his finger, he comes in here and he says, come on, come on. Yeah. Puts him number two all time a couple of weeks ago. And here's the block that he had earlier on Devin Harris. And we asked him earlier this week if he thought he would catch Akeem Olajuwon. Oh, no, I'm not. Trust me. I'm not going to be an eye. Trust me. I'd be hanging my jersey somewhere. <laughs> I've told him already that I'm not going to be around to catch him now. Why? After the foul here, Dirk Nowitzki argues the call with the official. Respect the game is what the officials are told to. Uh... Jason Terry has been quiet in this game. And Battier got a hand on it. Luther Head gets ahead of the pack for two. Jason Terry has been quiet in this game. And Battier got a hand on it. Luther Head gets ahead of the pack for two. He can free throw shooting. Battier lays it up and in with the left hand. Raper Austin hits a three. He would have already wanted to shoot it. t max still going to go for the two for one. Oh! Team for a three! On the shot clock. t max needs to get in the post. He's got Devin Harris on him. Well, he just took it. Tracy does Dallas. Four points, and Dallas calls a timeout. All right, Stackhouse gets in early here, and Matumbo blocks it. Grady from the corner. Oh! Stackhouse, it's knocked away by McGrady. In the open court, Terry's got it, and it's going to be Houston's ball anyway. Battier gets it up ahead to T-Mac. 
Rafer to jo- uh, Jawan Howard. And they're shooting 17 for 19 from the free throw line. 14 more free throws for the Rockets. That's going to be another turnover. Josh Howard trying to pick him up. McGrady goes baseline, reverses, and missed it. Matumbo gets it back for Houston. And back out to Battier. McGrady's open for a three. T for a three. McGrady! Harris inside, and a good strip of the ball by Battier. Josh Howard. McGrady. Howard will take his turn. Novitski comes out on McGrady. Down to Jawan Howard. Fakes Novitski for two. Novitski comes out to help. They double team McGrady. That leaves Jawan open and he hits. McGrady back to Jawan. He'll fire it up and in. Two seconds left. To McGrady. McGrady raises up. It counts. 44. This is kind of a broken play, but Team Hack makes something out of it. Another look at it. A lot of contact there. You've got to have your feet set if you're going to drudge. Good defense by Juwan. Nine and three without Yao Ming. And they're trying to hold their own. It's in the play. Now the Rockets without Yao. Steal by Luther. John Luca 